For the first time since 1999, seven of the top eight seeds have reached the quarterfinals at the Western and Southern Open. It's also the first time this year on the ATP World Tour. Topping the bill was Rafa Nadal against the in-form Mardi Fish. After his absolute marathon against Vadasco yesterday, Nadal couldn't have picked a much more difficult opponent. Fish has got pedigree here. He was runner-up last year and yet to lose serve in the tournament. Oh, good drop shot by Fish. Continuing to punish those legs of Nadal. Things haven't been going smoothly for Nadal recently and his frustration began to boil over. Second serve returns that he's missing halfway up the net. You don't see Nadal too often like that. Yes. Winning 6-3, 6-4, Fish recorded his first win over the Spaniard at the seventh attempt. Yes! Martin Fish. He just did up. 6-3, 6-4. Has defeated Rafael Nadal for the first time in his career. You know, I'd like to stay in the top ten for a long time, um, and I'll, I'll ride it as long as I can. Um, but I didn't have that one big win um, since I've been there. Uh, my last, my last big win was probably, you know, maybe Murray here last year. Um, that was my last, I think, top five win. You know, so it's been a while to beat. Uh, you know, a really top player, and um, I, I played a great match against Burditch at Wimbledon as well in the fourth round. But um, this one's bigger than that. A few things to improve. I want to be ready for for New York, and I'm gonna work on that. Um, I don't know if I will be in perfect conditions in New York, but for sure, everything I will try. Over on grandstand, number four seed Andy Murray faced Gilles Simon. The only non-top eight seed to squeak through. Murray loves these courts, and this was his fifth quarter-final appearance. break this time. After defeating Ferrer in three sets the day before, a similar upset never looked likely as Murray put Simon serve under severe pressure. Simon saved seven break points, but crucially Murray still broke him four times. Oh, what a and shot by Murray to end the set. Six it was another impressive victory for the Scot as he romped through to the semi-finals. Done it with great feel and some nice clinical precision. It's been a good week so far. Um, you know, obviously want to try and go a little bit further, but you know, after Montreal, it's been been perfect in, in many ways. And I'm glad I've managed to get some matches in and three good ones. Two more semi-final places up for grabs later in the day at the Western and Southern Open.